What's up guys? It's me, Garrett Smithley. Just kidding. Um, it's Brennan, Garrett's driving. Um, this is the start of the Sonoma vlog, but I'm starting it for him. Um, I feel like I'm going back to my, my old vlogging days. Yeah. I feel good about it. I feel but, like a professional for a while. Uh, I don't know about professional. I, 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 but I did, I tried. At least I gave full effort. It's not quite as good as yours, you know what I mean? But we're stoked because we're going to be driving through some crazy views, mountains, going on this road trip we're gonna be going down seeing the redwoods later this week it's gonna be pretty epic I'm pumped about that I'm yeah. super pumped about that it's gonna be so much fun it's gonna be awesome Pacific we're, Coast Highway right That's what's yeah, yeah 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 we're gonna do the whole thing so, I'm, I can't I'm like there's something to be said about giant trees that you can drive through yep. I gotta see it we gotta see it better than North Carolina trees a lot better than North Carolina. Virginia. North Carolina is just flat, is where we live. I mean, you know, other parts have mountains, but we're about to see some crazy stuff. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Tides changed and all the waters are full now. When we first drove through here, it was like empty. Yeah. Can we zoom? Oh, yes. Look at that. So this is day two of our travel. Hung out with Randy, watched some movies, and uh, now we're here at Mount Rainier National Park. Mount Rainier National yeah, Park? Yeah. It's a national park? And uh, it's pretty sick. We drove two hours, probably, from civilization. And, uh, well, I'll show you just in one second. Just stay tuned. All right, check this out. That is sweet. Worth the drive. We're trying to go down the mountain. I think we're about 150 feet higher than what we were down there. Ooh. Is it working? Yeah, I'm just yeah. going in his holes. I'm making feet holes. <laughs> it is pretty slick though. Slick, you heard it here first. This is just incredible. Look at the mount, like just. Dude, it's. Look, at, like, what more do you want? You don't need anything else. There's glaciers up there. You got feet holes. <laughs> we just need a snowboard and we would snowboard all the way down. This is actually a hill that I could snowboard. Just this one only for the little children? Well, the first time I went, I the think first it was. Time I went, I came back with extra metal in my arm. See, that's <laughs> what I wanted to avoid. Yeah, it's and not. It's not the best. I definitely. Well, I want to definitely snowboard again. I want to try it again. I just where I went. I don't know exactly where I went, but it was up near Boone. Oh yeah, I know people that go up there all the time. Well, the Kitty Mountain was too small, and the next one up was too big. I needed something in between. Yeah. I could go. I just couldn't stop. Yeah, stopping is a big, important part of the lesson. Yeah. You probably should have taken some lessons. When then again, I took a lesson and broke my wrist, so who knows. Some kid, like, wiped out in front of me, and I just, like, went sideways, and I went tumbling. It wasn't bad, good. Bad deal. Yep. All right, we're going to try to get down this thing. Right. I think it's the hamburger slide. There's no way. It's. I've, is it like a carnival ride? I don't know. It's kind of it creepy. If to it be is, this guy you. took it out of someone's yard. That's what it looks like. That's freaking wild. The hamburger on a random bridge in Washington State. Good view though. Goodness, this all these nicer homes now. People are looking at the bay right there. Oh my god, these people's views are insane. Oh, yep, there it is. It's coming in. Lindsay, yep. Lindsay, you're like, I don't know what you're doing, but you're missing it. Moon, moon, moonhead. She's missing it. She's missing it, moonhead. <laughs> <laughs> you're missing it. <laughs> Good morning. Happy Tuesday. I believe it's Tuesday. We are on day, what is this, three of our travel vlog. And we are on the coast. 
Mount Rainier was amazing. Hey, this cool little Mexican place in Estolia, I think. Check out these little villas that, that Lindsay found. Look at the little, that's, yeah, it's like sick. Like a little private little villa thing right on the beach. So we're gonna go see some rocks. There's some big old rocks over there. And then we're going to Redwoods, which I'm super excited about. Let's see what kind of stuff we can find today. Cannon Beach, big old rock in the middle of the ocean. California, baby. Boom. What a tree hugger. Good tree. <laughs> We've made it to the redwoods, as you can see. It's our next down. adventure. We're gonna go down this trail and There's see what happens. Should we should we read the map for yeah. no you're allergic to maps. <laughs> well, yeah. You, you said that's that's that way looks cool. It's pretty neat. This is pretty sick. We've been looking forward to this for like the whole trip. Round Creek Trail, if we go... We need to count how we're coming back to this trip. Why well, do you think this road goes back to the 101? Uh, yeah, I think so. If not, we'll just turn around. We got, we got plenty of time. We're gonna make it to where we need to go back tonight. And if we don't, what are we missing out on? <laughs> Wait, I don't want to be in the middle. <laughs> okay. <laughs> For safety? Yeah. In case there's a bear. That's cool. What's the thing with poison ivy? Three leaves. Well, there are lots of three leaves. Well, they're... What's that? That... No, uh, I don't know. Just don't touch any of the leaves. <laughs> <laughs> they're shiny. Well, I saw a lot of shiny ones. It's shiny three leaves. That could be poison ivy. It could be. But we all have long clothes on. I mean, this one's the biggest one. Yet. Oh, that's insane. It's absolutely insane. Hold on. I gotta get like a Well, you need a reference photo, though. Hold on. <laughs> Where are we at? Bigfoot land. Bigfoot land. Bigfoot land. Yeah, you look good. This is great. <laughs> Bigfoot. There's an eagle with a snake in it. Oh, look, they got all kinds of stuff in It's kind of crazy. It's just on the side of the road. All right, Moonhead, we're about to drive through a tree over here. Uh, oh, yeah, we got some bears here. You like it, Moonhead. There you go. Check them out. Good bears just for you. I hope you're going to put some music over this. Uh, Moonhead, we're taking a ride. A big tree. There's a big tree. Uh, there's another big tree. Look at these big trees. Oh, a lot of big trees. Lots of them. Look at these. I, I need to stop filming, Moonhead, because I need to focus on the trees and, and, and soak it up and take it in. Big tree guys this trip. Through the tree we go. All right, driving through the tree. 
It looks like the top. I, I wonder. We got to get out and look in here, I guess, too. Yeah, look at the big hole. Sure. Oh, wow. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty tight. tight. Oh, ooh, ooh, you better go left. <laughs> you better go left. <laughs> it is tight. Oh my god. Garrett brush and go left. I'm left. You need to be I'm almost touching over there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's it. Yeah, that'd be great. Here we are, the Motel 7. That's uh this is this is home. The Motel 7. Home for the next 3 days. No pets allowed. Well, take me away or keep me safe. Someone a It's pretty gnarly that this is built on the side of a mountain, and it's, and it's like in wine country, like big time. <laughs> we have made it to Sonoma Raceway. We're doing a karting event for Speedway Children's Charity, and uh, they're getting some instruction right now. But I guess. Me and Brad Perez and I think Connor Mozak are here and we're going to make lap time and then they're going to tag our lap time on our team's lap time and I guess the lowest lap time wins. I don't know. I've never been here before so, well, to this cart track. I've, I've raced at Sonoma before in Cup, but anyway, so... It's uh, it should be pretty fun. I, uh, me and Brad are watching some film and seeing, you know, we're competitive, right? Like everybody wants to do the best we can, so we're uh, we're gonna have some fun out here with some go karts. So we went to Sonoma and we did this go kart event, which was super fun. Drove 1,200 miles, and here we are. We're gonna see if this thing has a spare, but oh no. we got all. Oh yeah, it's 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 flat flat. We drove. I guess the good thing is yeah, we have a spare. We do have a spare. Yeah, yeah. All right, looks like we're gonna change this tire. I don't think we're gonna do it. I just I hear talking about it. Right, started. My nail. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I told you. <ya. laughs> Vlog content. Yeah. What's my time? Three <laughs> minutes, 30 seconds. Am I hired? Yes. <laughs> it is day, I don't even know what day it is, of our trip, but it's been awesome. The drive down was absolutely incredible. Seeing the mountain and seeing the ocean and the cliffs and the redwoods and all of it. It's been so cool. And then uh, drinking a little bit of Sonoma wine. That was cool. So now it's time to go to the racetrack. I'm sure you know now that, I think I've said this before, but Ty Dillon's in my car this week. He had a sponsor. And so he's in the car, which is good for the team. So I told Johnny that I would be here to support and spot if he needed or whatever. So head to the racetrack here in a few minutes with Brennan and Lindsay, my travel companions, which uh, we've had a lot of fun all together, eating a lot of good food. And yeah, it's just been just an awesome, awesome trip. So I'm uh, excited to be to the racetrack, even though I'm not driving, uh, even when I'm not driving, regardless of if I'm supposed to or not. It's always nice to be at the racetrack. So we're going to go hang out, see some squiggly race circuit things, Sonoma road course, and have some more fun.
matter. If I'm seeing that, you can You're not you can park that. anywhere you want. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> All finished up here at Sonoma. That went as far as the four car goes. That went as pretty good as as pretty good as well as it could have gone. Beat the 07, who is still behind us in points. Beat the 35 or the 53 beat the 44 so we picked up on some pretty good points so um unfortunately the six didn't make it which really sucks but um it is what it is we thought points wise we were going to be good enough and the four made it just by like less than a tenth so super super tight but um either way uh Almarola won and yeah i don't know how this is all going to fit into the vlog because this vlog is going to be wild I don't even know if this is gonna go into the vlog. But if it does, hello, thanks for watching. Um, if it doesn't, I'm just talking to myself. So here we are. <laughs> uh, I have a flight at five in the morning. So like it's 8 p.m. right now. So I think I'm just gonna grab some fast food and chill at the hotel and try to get some sleep before this crazy flight. So thanks for watching.